Welcome to PCB Heaven Tech Labs again. Today we will run some interesting experiments with thermocouples. I have provided myself a thermocouple wire. This, uh, this is usually used to extend thermocouples. And if you see, it's made, it has inside two different wires. This is the same like this one. You watch closely. These are two different wires. Notice the color, they are different. And this is a K-type thermocouple made of chrome and uh, aluminum alloys with nickel. And uh, also this type of thermocouple here. You may be already familiar with this, this thing. This is used to measure the temperature with simple multimeters like this one if they provide this function actually this goes to the multimeter this is also as you see a K-type thermocouple and on the other side of the wire there is only the thermocouple junction as you see so what I have to do to make this thing work is only to make a junction I have stripped both wires and I have connected them together and this is the only thing I need to do to make this work and I will use a multimeter in the 200 millivolt scale because thermocouples generate very slight voltages measured in microvolts maybe so let's begin I will turn on the multimeter and what I get is zero volts. Why? Because the thermocouple junction and the thermocouple to copper wire junction have the same temperature. And according to the second law of, ther of thermocouple metals, uh, a voltage cannot be sustained. So, uh, if you're interested about uh, the thermocouple theory of operation, you should better visit my webpage. This is www.pcbheaven.com and uh, you will find there an extended article about thermocouples and how they work. Let's the, see now this in action. I will change the voltage, bit, the temperature, sorry, the temperature between these two using a simple lighter. And let's see what will happen. As you see, immediately after start heating up the measuring junction, I begin to have readings in the screen of the multimeter. This means that this simple thermocouple works. And using the appropriate uh, table for K-type thermocouples I can uh, find out what is the temperature for example that the butane contained in this lighter can be achieved so let's see how hot can this thing be goes to 10 millivolts 15 millivolts, 18, 19, 20 millivolts, 21, 22 millivolts, 23.2.3, it's getting hotter, 23.6 millivolts. 25 millivolts 25 yeah. I would say that 25.2 millivolts is a reading so I will use this 
this table that you can find also in my website and I will search for the 25 millivolts somewhere here 25.2 millivolts somewhere here so the temperature is about 600 degrees maybe hotter about 608 to 9 degrees this is a hot lighter though so thank you for watching the first experiment follow the links that appear in your link in your screen to see the next experiments and don't forget to visit my website for more interesting experiments, articles and circuits.